This summer, camps for the Girl Scouts of the Green and White Mountains are going virtual. We know when we're operating six day camps and our resident camp across two states that it was not going to be something we could follow the state guidelines for and get those operational. Yesterday, day camps in New Hampshire were officially allowed to open, but Miller says they're convinced they made the right decision by not opening theirs. When we're dealing with a virus and our particular situation serving children from out of state as well as in state, we knew it would be far too difficult for us to ensure the safety of and well-being of the girls that we serve. Jasmine right Averbuck is the resident camp director and helping to bring the virtual experience alive. They are able to take the magic of camp and bring it to their homes with the help of um, online meetings. The camps will start a week from today, and the girls will be given help in creating the camping experience with their families. Cooking outdoors, we give them recipes of how they can do that um, on their own and at home in different ways. We give them pre-recorded videos to do outdoor hikes and adventures. Now, scouts can still enjoy an actual camping experience with their families at the resident camps on the weekends. And the Girl Scouts say there is plenty of room left in the virtual camps. Reporting live, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.